This is just the start. China has more sanction measures and tools available. The ominous sounding threat was issued by China's former Vice Commerce Minister, Wei Jingao. If you're wondering what's China threatening the world with this time, then this is what you need to know. China has decided to disrupt global supply chains once again. And if this reminds you of export bans it imposed during COVID, let us tell you this is different. This time it is clear it is using its control over critical material for semiconductor manufacturing as a weapon. China has decided to impose export ban on critical rare elements, gallium and germanium. Both these elements are critical for semiconductor manufacturing. And China is the primary global producer of these critical metals. What confirmed it as a threat is the statement of its former Vice Commerce Minister, who said, China's export control of chip-making materials was a well-thought-out heavy punch. Adding further that if restrictions targeting China's high-technology sector continue, then countermeasures will escalate. These minerals are critical to the production of semiconductors that are used in electrical vehicles, missile systems, solar cells, among other things. Companies affected by the ban are scrambling to secure alternative supplies. But what's worrying industry that this move could be followed by restrictions on rare earth exports? While this is primarily aimed at US tech companies, if you're wondering what will be the impact of this ban on India, as you know, India is in the initial stages of setting up chip manufacturing facilities in the country. Commenting on the ban, Minister of State for Electronics and IT Rajiv Chandrasekhar said that this will not have any impact on India. On the face of it, what the minister said sounds true, as the leading importers of China's gallium products are countries like Japan, Germany and the Netherlands. Similarly, the top importers of Chinese germanium products are Japan, France, Germany and the United States. But going forward, India should do what it can to ensure that it is not subject to the whims of the Chinese. However, this still leaves out one thing. Why did China resort to a ban on critical minerals? Experts have interpreted the Chinese Commerce Ministry's decision, justified on grounds of national security, as a reaction to the increased measures taken by Washington to limit China's technological progress. And according to analysts at Jefferies, the export controls implemented by China are perceived as the country's second major countermeasure following the ban it imposed on chip manufacturer Micron.